Uh -huh. Hello, everybody. As usual, for the club. And today, we had a special review. Because, what, for the first time, we reviewed the human pickles, the carny mask that I have in my collection. But also, uh, something special. Composite effects, silicone gloves, the imp gloves, painted in human skin tone, for matches my Hugo the Mutant and the Sin of Gluttony, because the skin tone, as you can see, is equal to my Sin of Gluttony. And my Yugo the Mutant. Switch very well with also other human masks, like, for example, Pickle the Carney, but are probably better for those two masks. Because the skin tone, as you can see, is pale, but a little bit more darker than Pickle's. But well, Let's start with pickles. As you remember probably, I have another pickles in my collection that is Pickles Joker. With hair, the clown makeup. This one is the human one, the Caucasian skin tone one. Fits so well. Like the Joker one, is bold, cool, can be a lot of characters, like for example a Tug, <laughs> a sort of cartoony Jack Nicholson, or a Popeye, for example, oh, uh, Popeye the Sailor Man, or something like that, or can be, uh, if you remember, um, a particular cartoon of the 90, like uh, Biker Mice from Mars, uh, is equal to a goon of the main villain Limburger, that I do not remember the name in, uh, uh, in USA, but here in Italy he was called Morchia. Uh, or grease face, something like that. And the mask itself is pretty, pretty equal to him. Moves so well. I had a reinforcer at it at the size of the corner of the mouth, as usual. And the skin tone matches perfectly my face, as you can see. I don't need black makeup around my eyes. I can add it, of course, but it's not necessary. So, now let's talk about the hands. I am not really a big fan of silicone hands, even if we are talking of composite effects that are, of course, the top notch, because, as you can see, they are pretty thick. So comfy. Movement is so great, even if I have little hands, as I have indeed. Um, this particular one, the imp gloves, the three finger gloves, if we can uh, name that in this way, are pretty comfy. You have your thumb, perfectly movable, and your other fingers are divided in two, split in two, like uh, Spock, for example, or the Penguin, or a sort of uh, American Horror Story character, for example. Uh, if I remember well, this is also a medical condition, uh, three dotly, if I, if I add the 
the medical name uh, right. The details are pretty insane, as you can see. You have horrible nails. Soft, of course, they are in silicone. The skin tone color is absolutely outstanding. Veins. They are absolutely a cool effect, even if they are not the best fitted ones. I have other gloves in my collection. I was forced to have them, because they were sold in set with the masks. I have crusty the zombie gloves, the pink and glow-in-the-dark green strong gloves for the 8-bit Jason Wolfris, if you remember well, I did also a video of it, and I will do a review of it pretty soon. I have also um, the this one, those ones, the three finger gloves, and if I remember well, I have also a black and white meat bag zombie gloves that are pretty pretty large. The best fit one for my for my hands are crusty one and the strong gloves one. I have little fingers, little hands, my my fingers, hands here. Here we have a lot of space, as you can see. But they are not that uncomfortable. The meat bag ones are pretty pretty big. Are probably the biggest gloves I have. But those ones are pretty useful, are pretty cool. Nothing really uncomfortable, but my advice in those long years of collecting was always this. If you have the money for a mask and gloves set, step away from the gloves and buy two masks instead. Because gloves are cool, but are indeed a little bit useless. Uh, they are amazing, as I can see. But as you can imagine, probably, you do a lot of movements in surplus than a mask with the gloves. Because you can grab things, move your hands, enlarge your hands, touch things, uh, make things like that, that are, of course, a little bit dangerous. And, well, gives to your gloves. Uh, not so very long shelf life because you do a lot of movements with them and the um, uh, the damage point of them is pretty high. I have always used them with care, a lot of care, a lot of care, instead of a mask. And when you put them on, and when you put them off, you need to do this thing. You need to voila. And here it is. Also, another problem is a lot of sweat is fixed inside the globe. Because you have basically no space for dry them. Instead of a mask that you can pull off and pull on a lot of times, gloves are uh, a little pain in the ass, if we can say that, but thanks to the sweat, you can remove them pretty easily, but 
If now I wanna put them on again, oh boy, oh boy, this is the real nightmare. Cause now they are a little sticky inside and is pretty difficult. Alright, put them in position rightly. So well, my dear friends, I hope you have enjoyed this new um, review, and well, as always, thanks for watching. Enjoy your life, make comments, subscribe if you like, have a great summer, stay safe, wear your mask, well, not this mask, but well, you have understand my point. And see you soon for other videos on my collections, creations, and the other funny stuff Warren will be in my channel. Next video will be a pretty special and one of a kind mask of the mouth from Composite Effects. And stay tuned for more Lady Dimitrescu videos. A lot of you have pleased so much with this video. I am pretty happy that you like the real flesh Lady Dimitrescu. Stay tuned for um, a complete review of pro and cons of real flesh in general and the mask itself. And of course, the other funny stuff. Who are and will bring my channel.